difficult time, a time where we can really reflect as human beings. The de facto and the jury, President of the Republic of Uganda, the entire leadership of the The leadership of ANT very closely worked with my husband and his cousin. The church leadership. My dear family, the members of my family of Joy, my sister. The children. Dr. Philip, Dr. Bennett, and Doctor, and also your other brothers. There's a doctor who helped us when we were in the for Potro. Yes! Prof, where are you even yesterday? You know, you helped us a lot. My sisters led by Naume and my brothers, the community of Jolie here in Western Uganda, Mitoma, the LC5, the LC1, and the women. In the interest of time, I will not speak a lot. I already spoke yesterday. We had a whole day, Dr. Nina Zedriga Waru Abugu. I come from West Nile region. I'm a Lubara. And I would like also to have a Sega here. This is the impact of Jode, my sister, spread all over in practice. Met at him and worked very closely. I was honored and humbled to have been not only a co-deputy president, but a sister in the struggle. A sister in the Nook family. A true sister who loved from her heart. Jolie was so selfless. She would come with her cup of Milk? Knowing I actually am lactose intolerant, she would say, Sha, you have to drink this milk. Eh? Because I know it is not going to do anything bad to you. Jolie was so selfless. She would come to Northern Uganda in solidarity. Today, Your Excellency and the entire team, Jolie has spoken loud and clear. When you touch people, it's not how you dress. It's not the English you speak, not even the Runyangore or the Nubar. But it is how you touch people's lives. She touched our lives. I'm going to be very brief. I know you are on panic mode. But today is her day. And I've come all the way from Arua, border in South Sudan. And here at Congo, and today is the only day, it may be even my last day here. So, just give me five minutes, I'm a time conscious person. What can I say? We loved her so much, because she loved us first. The entire women league was with Jonah in the hospital. They came with a humble contribution of Sambutunda, 500,000, I remember. We wish, Jode, we wish we could be here with her throughout. But the Lord gives and the Lord takes. The children, we are present. Knowing the Bible in the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 3, there's a time for everything. It's now a time for us today to love, to give each other the best, to forgive. Johnny struggled with the country. Johnny struggled with us. Johnny
really struggled with the community. I would like to call one thing as her sister. If she ever hurt you, forgive her. If she ever hurt you, forgive her because she would not have known. She would have asked for forgiveness. I know Jody. Jody mentored me to be calm. Jody mentored me to be patient. Jody mentored me to embrace whatever comes your way. Very humble. Jody mentored me not to complain. Yes. So I am asking each one of us, should you by mistake still hold her in your heart for whatever reason? Whether at the party or in the home, forgive her, I'm asking. Not only asking, as a lawyer, I'm demanding, forgive her. We are, we are the laws, we have been the whole of Uganda. Yes. The message, specifically as I go on to, go, to invite my colleague who will be inviting the president, for us to reflect on forgiveness and to reflect on touching people's lives, not fighting with them, not imprisoning them, not blocking them, not intimidating them, not blackmailing them, is from the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 3, verse 1 to 11. There's a reason, there's a season for everything. By the way, in the Catholic Church, this is the reading today. Today's reading. There is a season for everything. A time for every occupation under heaven. Including a time to boast and a time to be humble. A time for giving birth. A time for dying. A time for planting. A time for uprooting what has been planted. A time for killing. A time for healing. A time for knocking down. A time for building. A time for tears. A time for laughter. A time for mourning. A time for dancing. A time for throwing stones away. A time for gathering them up. A time for embracing. A time to refrain from embracing. A time for touching. A time for losing. A time for keeping. A time for throwing away. A time for tearing. A time for sowing. A time for keeping silent. A time for speaking. A time for loving. A time for hating. A time for war. A time for peace. Jolie. You were that old. Thank you so much. Rest in peace. Rest in power. I proceed to invite our colleague, Honorable John Baptist Nambese, whose father we buried grandly. Together with you, we traveled together. And we know our chauffeur who took us. Thank you so, so much. Family, I will be extremely brief because I see we are at the press.